spring is around the corner when you start talking about all the food carts and the food trucks and all the festivals that those are usually at right today. Unfortunately, going to feel like a winter day and it's going to be very rainy. So we do have a first alert for that. Here is the weather system that's going to bring us all of the rain already bringing heavy rain to parts of the Florida Panhandle, Alabama and Mississippi. And for us, we are dealing with a few showers this morning. Metro is dry, but south of the city, hey, rain is knocking on your door. Carrollton, you are about to get some rain. LaGrange, rain has been on and off for you for the past hour. Heard County, parts of southern Coweta County as well. Looks like Fayette County may be getting a light sprinkle, and that's just the beginning, guys. It's going to be a rainy day right now is going to be the driest time of the day as we head into the afternoon. Expect that coverage to increase. Looking over Marietta Square, it is cloudy and boy, is it cold out there. Not only is it going to be rainy, but windy and cold, so that's going to make it feel colder. Feeling like 37 in Atlanta, feeling like 34 in Lawrenceville, Gainesville, feeling freezing this morning. Athens feeling like 33 in LaGrange. It feels like 40 where you are. So as we go through the day, we'll take you through first alert future cast hour by hour. Rain will move in from the south and push north through the afternoon. So by 12 o'clock, if you have brunch plans today, if you are leaving church, maybe grabbing some lunch with family and friends in Midtown, rain will be moving in. Rain continuing south of the city where you could pick up about an inch of rain between today and early tomorrow morning. By 3.30, rain widespread, but look at the temperatures. We're in the mid to upper 40s, even low 40s south of the city. If you have any dinner plans tonight. Here's seven. Notice some pockets of heavier rain, the yellow and orange colors. That's indicating some pockets of slightly heavier rain possible today. And as we make our way through the overnight hours, rain will start to taper off, but it could continue into the morning commute. We do have a wind advisory today for just about all of the area with the exception of Banks County down to Oconee County. So it doesn't include Athens with wind gusts upwards of 40 miles per hour possible, especially south of the city late tonight. Most of us will experience wind gusts between 25 to 35, but that is still a very blustery day. As we make our way through the afternoon into the evening, the wind really going to be kicking up with, again, that isolated gust as high as 40 possible south of the city this evening. That means it's going to feel like the 30s all day. If you have lunch or brunch plans, it's going to feel like the upper 30s feeling like the low 30s as we make our way into the late evening. Now, as we head into tomorrow morning for the morning commute, we'll continue our first alert as showers will be possible. So take a look on our first alert seven day forecast. Rain will be possible for that morning commute. Just take your time. It's still going to be breezy. The roads are more than likely going to be slick from the rain overnight, so we're just giving you that heads up now. You'll want to add some extra time. So for today, the rain and the wind and the cold for that first alert, 90% coverage of rain, 40s, but really feeling like the 30s. Mid 50s tomorrow will dry out by the afternoon, though, and then sunshine returns on Tuesday. We'll wake up in the 30s with highs in the mid to upper 50s. Cold morning on Wednesday with highs in the upper 50s again Wednesday. Clouds will build Thursday. That's all a precursor to another weather system that that could bring us a chance for rain both Friday and Saturday with temperatures back in the 60s. Here's what's coming up.